Hey everybody, this is Intro, and in this tutorial, we're going to be going over the local MAC address and how to find it within command line. So without any further ado, I'm going to hurry up, type in this code, we type in git mac, press enter. And then, we get these two network interface cards that'll pop up. Network interface cards are what will pop up right here, which is your ethernet on the back of your desktop, or it's built in if you have a laptop. So Basically what we need to know about the physical address is that it's the same thing as the MAC address. They're just two different names to call the same address. And what these numbers do, or numbers and letters do, are their identifiers. So the first four combinations of letters and numbers in this top row here, all the way up to 5C, are 2AE347 and 5C, are used by the manufacturer to identify the type of networking card or any type of um, device. And the last four, our 3381, are actually used to identify who is sending the information. So for a quick example, if I have two networks, which I do right here, and I have my bottom network, and say I had a packet from the top network that I wanted to send to my bottom network. If I was to actually analyze the packet and go into my network, I w or Wireshark, I would find out that 3381 was the physical address of the device that gave me that or that file or that packet. So knowing that, we can identify this device right here. We don't need the rest of these numbers and letters to identify it. These are just for manufacturer use. And that's basically all I wanted to show you guys in this tutorial. Um, just a big thing, remember that these last four digits are just for communication and these first um, eight digits are used for the manufacturer. Um, meet me in my next tutorial and we'll be going over a something a little bit different. It's called ARP and please like and subscribe and you guys have a good day.